All the robbery cases were reported in the Havana informal settlement on the outskirts of Ventuk and suspects fled the scene with properties which included cash, cell phones, recharge vouchers and beer. The suspects in the housebreaking and theft offences also got away with an unspecified amount of money, laptops and cell phones. The Commerce Police is also investigating a hit-and-run case in which a pedestrian was run over in the Bandumende Mfayo Road. Meanwhile, the Omsati region recorded three suicide cases, an armed robbery and a drowning. The Oshkoto region recorded a rape case and a reckless and negligent driving. Kabango, Omaheke and Odonjupa regions each recorded single murder cases. Head of Police Public Relations Division, Deputy Commissioner Edwin Gangwashivi, told the media that the Ondajupa Police is also investigating rape and contravention of ammunition cases. The police received information that a certain person was in possession of explosives. And when they went to investigate, they found a hand grenade and nine rounds of nine millimeter pistol. Uh, hidden outside in the toilet of the suspect. The nine rounds were confiscated, but as for the hand grenade, the, our explosive division was summoned to come and defuse the hand grenade. Gangwashivi said the suspects who committed crimes in the commerce regions are yet to be apprehended, while the regions have thus far made several arrests. Suspects are expected to appear in court tomorrow.